Alright guys, this is a continuation of the rebuild uh, part series on my 1974 bug. So, over here, we have these bagging plates. I have them in engine degreaser. We're getting all the extra grease and stuff off of there. While that's happening, I'm going to be sanding this down for repaint. They're not perfect, but again, it's a budget build, guys, so I'm not too crazy worried about it. The car just has to stop for me. These over here, you can't see them, but they're the A-arms. After this is sanded down, we're going to get these in the navel jelly that dissolves rust. And then after that, we're just going to have to wash it down and clear them of all any materials. All right. So, safety is number one priority, guys. I don't have the safety on right now. The glasses. Well, look, when you're using this equipment, these little metal pieces will fling off and get in your eye so be very careful when you're using this equipment guys you only got one set of eyes okay so let's get to it so there is pitting on here uh, to get rid of the pitting you can uh, take your uh, a grinding wheel something that's a medium uh, texture and just get it as flat as possible for your your wheels to bolt up to here but it's not too crazy bad and i'm not too crazy worried about it like i said if, if this was uh like like a rotor i'd be more worried about it but after i get this stuff all cut down and everything i, I can go over it with a little uh like an angle grinder and just you just hit it and get it as flat as possible get all these up uh, i'll show you so when you're done sanding on all of this and you get these little deep pits out, you can sit there with the angle grinder and just get it as flat as possible so that your, uh, your mounting surface is flat. Yeah. But yeah guys, this is my day off. Just, I'm just doing a little bug work here and there. Eventually we're going to get it done. Your standard pliers out if you don't have specialty equipment. Just start breaking these down. Get the springs off. Put that somewhere we're not going to lose it, guys. I've had big trouble with losing tools and parts. So. Again, you don't need a uh, compressor for this. Just use your handy dandy hand tools, they'll, they'll come apart. The quickest uh, brake assembly I've did in the, I mean brake assembly I've did actually to be honest with you. That's my day off today guys, back up working on the bug. So yeah, just, you don't need to take this apart but mine's well. For the time being I'm reusing these ones. They say you're bringing back lunch. You're so sweet. Uh, 
done. It's assembled. Here. Like a soap. Underwater wheel on these things. Not in a great position to record at the moment, so whatever I get is that whatever I get for the footage. I'm more worried about getting the thing properly coated. Should have enough to do both a arms and the backing plates but if i come up straight i'll have to just go buy uh, more when i get my paycheck because this is a self-funded project like most projects <laughs> we are self-funded if you'd like to support me come hit me up i'm glad i left this wire on here too because I wouldn't be able to touch it really. And I'm not trying to touch this uh, mixture of phosphoric acid and other stuff with my bare hands. They recommend you not touch it actually. I have a spray bottle. I'm probably gonna put uh, soapy water in it and just spray it down. It's harder than you think to get this stuff off of. So. I'm gonna let it sit a little bit longer than recommended. Because it, 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 it can't hurt to leave it on a little longer. I think that's all pretty much done, guys. Kill it, sit for a while. I'll put a little bit more on just because. And they're just sitting on the ground to be honest with you guys. Yeah, just set her on the ground. Wish they sold this stuff in a bigger bottle. But it's quite tiny. Quite tiny bottle. I think I'm going to focus on the super rusty areas on this one.
the pitted areas I'm doing a thicker coating on it just so it gets all the way down in there. I think I'm gonna cut the video because it's uh, taking a while. So I'm gonna get back to you when I can.